Hello students, welcome to e-classes of PN Amase High School. We will continue with our chapter number 7. Can you see the pattern? Question number 9. Fill in the empty space by extending the pattern as per rule. First part of question number 9. Here 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10 is equals to 55. If we add all these numbers, we will get the answer as 55. Then 11 plus 12 plus 13 plus 14 plus 15 plus 16 plus 17 plus 18 plus 19 plus 20. If we add all these numbers, we will get 155 as an answer. In the same way, we have to write down the missing numbers and then we have to add them. We will get the answer as 55, then 155, then 255 and then 355 and so on. So remaining one first part of question number 9 you have to do by yourself. Now second part of question number 9 here 1 plus 3 is equals to 4 is equals to 2 multiplied by 2. Here two odd numbers are taken 1 and 3. We will add them we will get 4. And if we multiply 2 by 2 we will get 4 as answer. Now in the next step 1, 3, 5. All the three odd numbers are given. And if we add them we will get 9. And 9 means 3 multiplied by 3. 3, 3 is 9. Then 1, 3, 5, 7. We will add. We will get 16 as an answer. 16 means 4 multiplied by 4. Then again in the next step we will add 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9. If we add all these numbers we will get 25. 25 means 5 multiplied by 5. In the same manner we have to follow the rules and extend the pattern. Do the remaining Second, uh, remaining part of sum number 2 by yourself. Question number 10. Fill in the blanks by extending the pattern as per rule. Here also we have to extend the pattern as per the rule. 1 multiplied by 1 is 1. Then now we have to take 2 times 1. 1, 1, 11. 11 multiplied by 11. So the answer is 121. Here both the side 1 we have to write. And now in the place of 1 we have written here 2. So the answer is 1, 2, 1. Then 3 times 1 we have to take 111 multiply by 111. Now again 1, 2 we will write on both the side 1, 2 and 2, 1. Here 1, 2 we will write and here we will reverse the order and write 2, 1. And here 1 was written then we have used 2 and now we will write 3. So the answer is 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. Now 4 times 1 we will take 1111 multiplied by 1111. So the answer will be 1, 2, 3 we will write here and then this 1, 2, 3 we will write in reverse order as 3, 2, 1 and here in the place of 3 we will write 4 in middle. So the answer is 1, 2, 3, 4, 3, 2, 1. Then again 4 times 5 times 1 we will use 11,111, 11,111, here again 1, 2, 3, 4 we will write as it is and then 4, 3, 2, 1 in reverse order we will write and in the place of 4 we will write 5. So the answer is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now 6 times 1 we will use 1 lakh 11,111 multiplied by 1 lakh 11,111. Answer will be same 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. First we will write down as it is. Then in the reverse order 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. In the place of 5 we will write 6. So the answer is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Students in the same way we have to follow the rule and extend the pattern. So the second and third part of question number 10 you have to do by yourself. Question number 11, fill in the empty spaces by extending the pattern as per the rule. Here first we have to find out the rule and then we have to extend the pattern. First part is 12 multiplied by 2 plus 3 is equals to 27. Here 12 is taken and then we have to multiply it by 2 and then we have to add 3. Then next 12 multiplied by 3. Here 12 we have taken as it is in the place of 2 we have written 3 and again we have to add this with 3. We will get 39 as an answer. Same manner 12 multiplied by 4 plus 3 is equals to 51. 12 multiplied by 5 plus 3 is equals to 63. 12 multiplied by 5. Here it is written in the place of 5 we will write now as 6. 12 multiplied by 6 plus 3 is equals to 75. Students remaining 
first part of question number 11 you have to do by yourself now second part of question number 11 here 15 is given 15 multiplied by 1 plus 1 is equal to 16 then again 15 is taken same and in the place of 1 we have used 2 and in here also in the place of 1 we have used 2 15 multiplied by 2 plus 2 is equal to 32 here the number which we are multiplying the same number we have to add also then 15 multiplied by 3 plus 3 is equal to 48 15 multiplied by 4 plus 4 is equal to 64 students in the same way remaining second part of question number 11 you have to do by yourself Question number 12. Draw the shapes in the blanks and write the numbers in them as per the pattern. Here we have to draw the shapes and then we have to write the numbers according to the pattern. A part of question number 12. Here example is given 24 plus 19 plus 37 is equal to 37 plus 24 plus 19. This is left hand side and this is right hand side. Both the sides should be equal. Here you can see 24 is written on left hand side. On right hand side also 24 is written. 19 and 19 are also written on both the side and 37 is also written on both the side. So first part of A 215 plus 120 plus dash 600 plus dash plus 120. Here on left hand side 600 number is missing and on right hand side 215 number is missing. So we will write here as 600 and here 215. So now 215 plus 120 plus 600 is equal to 600 plus 215 plus 120. Students remaining A part of question number 2 you have to do by yourself. Now B part of question number 12. 48 into 13 is equal to 13 into 48. In A part we have to add the numbers and in B part we have to multiply the number and the numbers on both the side left hand side and right hand side are same here 48 is on both the side and 13 is also on both the side so first part of B 27 into dash 72 into dash here 72 is missing here 27 is missing we will write 72 and 27 here now 27 into 72 is equal to 72 into 27 remaining B part of question number 12 you have to do by yourself Question number 13. Find the sum of all the numbers in the square of 3 into 3 in the calendar as per example. Students here, we have to find out the sum of all the numbers. Sum means we have to add all the numbers which are written in the square of a calendar. Here, A. In A box, 1, 2, 3, 8, 9, 10, 15, 16, 17 numbers are given. In B, 4, 5, 6, 11, 12, 13, 18, 19, 20 numbers are given. And in C, 15, 16, 17, 22, 23, 24, 29, 30, 31 numbers are given and in D, 12, 13, 14, 19, 20, 21, 26, 27, 28 numbers are given. Here, example is given for square A. The smallest number is equal to 1. Here in square A, you can see the smallest number is 1. Then we have to add 8 in that number. We will add 1 plus 8. We will get 9. Multiplying it with 9. Again, we will multiply this 9 with 9. 9, 9 size 81. Or multiplying the middle number with 9. Thus, the sum of all the numbers in the square A is 81. If we add 1, 2, 3, 8, 9, 10, 15, 16, 17, we will get the answer as 81. In the same way, we have to find out the sum of all the numbers of square B. Now, in square B, you can see the smallest number is 4. The smallest number is equal to 4. Add 8 in that numbers. 4 plus 8 is 12. Multiplying it with 9. 12, we have to multiply by 9. 12, 9 is 108. Thus, the sum of all the numbers in square B is 108. Students, if we add 4, 5, 6, 11, 12, 13, 18, 19, 20, we will get 108 as an answer. Try to solve second and third part of question number 13 by yourself. Question number 14. Find the surprising number by following the steps as directed. We have to find out a surprising number by following the steps. For example, what is your age? As your age might be 10, 11 and 12 here. 10 age is considered. Now we have to double it. So we will multiply this 10 by 2. 10 2 size 20. Then multiply by 5. Then again 
this 20 we will multiply by 5 25 is 100 divide by 10 now we have to divide this 100 by 10 by dividing 110 we will get 10 so we got the same number which we have taken as your age here the answer is same as your age now for sum we have to follow the steps and then do the sum what is your friend's age students as your age might be 10 11 12 here we are taking 12 as your friend's age now we have to double it so we will multiply it by 2 12 2 size 24 multiply by 5 then again this 24 we will multiply by 5 we will get 120 as a answer then divide by 10 again this 120 we have to divide by 10 so we will get 12 what do you get we get 12 we got the same number which we took as your friend's age student try to solve second and third part of question number 14 by yourself with this we end our chapter number 7 can you see the pattern thank you